Hey everyone, here we go again, continuing on with the quest to open up one of every pack of magic cards, almost, with Zendikar through 10th edition. Let's go. Hopefully you've been enjoying this series as I go through it. Uh, it's a little weird because I kind of go quickly through the commons and they don't linger too long, but that is how this series is going. So let's just jump right into it with Zendikar. Oh man, hard to get into that pack. There we go. Here we go, Hideous End. Which I hope is not the case for this whole series. Herda, Hatchling, Tangle Sap, Gatekeeper of Malakir. Geyser Glider, Feast of Blood, Balaged Thief is the rare. And we will scan it this time. 47 cents. And some tip for a quest there. Next up, 2010 Corset. Which is kind of difficult to get open. Here we go. Let's go. Windrake. Assassinate. The kind of corset stuff, like Unsummon, that you see over and over. The Harvest. Hope none of that was important. Yawning Fisher, Fireball, Howling Banshee, Rise from the Grave, and Ball Lightning. Elemental is the rare. Reprinted in Jumpstart, among others. Actually, two bucks for that version. Tokens and counters. Here we go with Alara Reborn. A Jund Hackblade. Codal. Stormblade. Putrid Leech. I love that almost all of this stuff is multicolor. The Pride Mage, Hush Blade, Border Post, Uncommon's Messenger Falcons, Giant Ambush Beetle, Dragon Appeasement, and not a rare, not a rare, a rare, Lightning Reaver, Zombie Beast. 79 cents from Alara Reborn. This is the first. I've never opened a pack of Conflux before. Hopefully you get something good. Temper Temper. Bonesaw reprinted later. Valiant Guard. Grixis Illusionist. Gluttonous Slime, Mana Force Mace, Scornful Aether Lich, got an Angel Token, and an Island, and a Scepter of Insight, and a Foil Dark Temper. Nothing big there. Nice foil on that, common though. Shards of Alara. Alien Elf. Call to Heal. Sanctum Gargoyle. Leotau. Bant. Grixis. Fate Stitcher. That's pretty good. Kasali Ambusher. Algae Gareel. Goblin Assault. I think that's pretty decent. Let's scan it up. 49 cents reprinted in Mystery Booster. The original 85 cents, cool planes, and a goblin token. Even tied next. Edge of the Divinity. Good common. I'll go back and pick that out later. Skulkin. Trow. Dream Thief. Another Trow. 
Moon is Grace. I love these blocks here. The fairy um, tribes. So this is interesting. Rules tip. I don't know if I've opened one of these before either. Sulky Hedge Maze. Sturdy Hatchling. Chaotic Backlash. And a Ward of Bones. That's pretty good too. And a Foil Monstrify. Ward of Bones, 11 bucks. Shadow Moor. A lot of good cards in this set. Can I get any of them? Last Breath. Cohort. Presence of Gond. Shield of the Oversold. A couple good commons there. Zealous Guardian. Wisps. Glamour Spinners. Heap Doll. Kithkin Rabble. And Crag and Wick Cremator. Definitely not a good one. Elf Warrior Token. Reprinted in Double Masters. The original. Nothing special. Alright, Morning Tide is next. Sentinel. Fairy. The Pax Disdain. Bosk Banneret. Schoolmaster. Some, some good comments here. Roar of the Crowd. Sage of Fables. Hunting Triad. Thornbite Staff. Get on comments too. And Cream of the Crop. Elemental token. Cream of the Crop is about five bucks. Here we go, Lorwin. Kithkin Knight. Well, Boggart. Streambed Aquatex. Fault Grinder. Dodger. Brawler. Woodland Guidance. Giant Harbinger. Sentry Oak. And Thousand Year Elixir. That's pretty decent right there. Yep. 12.88 for a different version. Yep, 13 something. Commander card right there. 10th edition core set. Last pack in this video. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like and comment. Check out the rest of the videos in this series. And stay tuned for a short version of all of these on or about New Year's. Pincher Beetles, Naturalize, Spark Elemental, Deathmark, Pyroclasm, and Glorious Anthem. And a forest. It's a buck. And a wasp token. There you go. All right. Thank you very much. Tragic MTG. Catch you on the next one.